What's up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Prince of Persia, The Lost Crown. In the last episode, we discovered that the person who was a party pooper was... I think, I think they made her a party pooper so that we would know that she was a... Or that, that we'd kind of have an off vibe about her, but apparently she ki has kidnapped the prince of... I th are we in Persia? You know, I never actually uh, paid attention to work out where we are. I assume we are in Persia. Um, but yeah, the, the prince was kidnapped, and now we are on expedition with the rest of the crew, trying to find him. And in the last episode, we left off uh, entering this kind of temple, ancient city place um, that has some kind of connection, I guess, to... Uh, where she wants to go. She wanted to be touched by the bird, like this big bird phoenix thing, um, to get power, I think, is what we learnt. Um, we'll have to refresh our memory on that, but, um, yeah, and that's kind of where we left off, and we're in the midst of searching this ancient city for some kind of clue, I would assume. Uh, and yeah, we... In terms of the gameplay, we found that the combat was uh, a little bit challenging and kind of like has this like nuanced sort of um, uh, like it, it's it's simple in its controls, but it has this complexity to it that I'm really enjoying. Uh, we haven't we we just started to get to the kind of like puzzle platforming as kind of puzzle platforming uh, aspect. We're doing a little bit more platforming, uh, so hopefully we get to see some more uh, some more of that in this episode and kind of if they do any kind of uh interesting parkour platforming like we're used to in the prince of persia games um but yeah i'm excited to get back into this so uh, let's not waste too much time on the intro and let's just jump straight back into it um yeah where we left off we were where were we we have we had an archer over here um, this is a, a couple of days later since uh playing playing for the last episode so i think Oh, we're heading up here. We had the archer, so yeah, I'm, I'm liking the I'm liking the combat. I I would like to see how the um how we go with the platforming. Currently, we got a little bit of parkour with the with this this kind of thing, which is already fluent. So I'm I'm enjoying this. I I want to see you know it'd be cool. I, we. We haven't had a wall run. Like, we, we can cling to a wall. Hold on. Can I do it? We can cling to a wall, but there hasn't been a wall run yet. So I wonder if that will be something we unlock, or whether that will at all be in this game. Um, where do we go? Oh, we go this way? But yeah, I'm curious as to... Oh, hello. Oh, he's got ex I that was explosive arrows. Man, the the combat is so fluent. Yeah, I'm curious to see how how our parkour will kind of uh, level up as well. We had a bit of combat combat level up. Now, oh, I hit that button. Oh, we have to start all the way back here. Okay. This is going to be challenging. <laughs> I might have to drop the difficulty if I can't get past this. Yeah, in the last episode, we're struggling to get past these guys. And it's, uh... That, ooh! Ooh! Wait, that didn't happen before. I I wasn't able to block that. So I don't know if that's like, if there's a way to counter that. You, when you, so when you press the trigger, it will trigger the ability to kind of like do a, a counter, but you have to time it right. But it doesn't seem that you can block those attacks. Like, ready? Oh! Timed it. Yeah, see? I can't, I can't like do a, a proper block or a dodge. So I have to time it right. 
Uh oh. Okay, do I have to time that right? Because I would have been dead. And it hits for so much damage. Okay, we're almost full health. Is there anything this way? We check this way, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> good to know we don't have full damage, that's good. At least, not yet. I assume there'll be like spikes or something if we don't have full damage to... Okay, archers are... have less health, by the looks of it. Can I get up there? Ooh. Nah. Maybe, maybe the later. Is this a, a cheap, a cheap way to attack? What do you cut out? Oh, oh! I just realized I have low health. Oh, I, li I like that. You see how he knew I was gonna come up that way? Oop. All right, we're getting to puzzle platforming sort of stuff. All right. I need a checkpoint. Is this a checkpoint? I push down to cross over a platform. Oh, is this what this is? What? The sim simur simurger. <laughs> I'm not really good at reading. Uh, the simurger is justice. <laughs> I'm gonna need help with reading these words. Is justice and the measure of all things. From the plans of the plans of Fars to the Nile Valley. Interesting. Interesting that it references the Nile. Is that close to Persia? Um The protective shadows of the majestic flight tempers the warmth lavish uh the warmth lavished by Mithra. The ears of wheat, barley. A. A. G. L. O. L. 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 I've never seen that word before. And. In. In. Ork? Kun? Corn? In. In. Corn? Man, what are these words? <laughs> turn ripe. Uh, turn ripe without drying out. The harvest. Okay, so it's like a a stone that helps with rain, I guess. The harvest is prosperous and feed uh, and feed the people. The harvests are prosperous and feed the people. As long as his wing grace the Persian sky, happiness. I'm gonna have to look up these these names. Sim, I I remember them saying the word in the last episode, but I can't remember what it is. Smugush, Shmugush. <laughs> well, you guys get to uh, watch me struggle reading in this series. What is this? Oh, that's cool. Oh, what are you doing here? This place is too dangerous for a child. No, hello. Come on, Saragon. Oh, Saragon. Sa Sa Saragon. Don't worry about me. I know the Citadel better than anyone. I know every step. I even go where others can't. Really? I've chatted and argued with every creature. And I know every tree here. Like this one. 
Are they? These trees oh. are special. I, I like this whack -whack. kind. That's what he said. They have the purest of Athra. So, stand beneath its leaves to restore your energy. A health tree. Good to good to know. Mount Car. Tell me, you say you know all here. We're in search of soldiers like us. Our prince is being led by an a general. Have you seen anyone like that? A prince? There hasn't been a prince here in so long. I've only seen you. I mean, I do look like the prince. Well, if you've lost your friend in Mount Calf, then you're going to need an Eye of the Wanderer. What's that? It's a very rare, very ancient... Oh, we have dialogue history. I didn't even see that. for you. Oh, Go cool. On. What's it doing? Try it. All right. Oh, it's a map. Oh, what's down here? We got a couple of things. Oh, we missed a bunch. Wait, I think this one was the... Uh, this was blocked off by a door or something. Didn't see that one, though. So... I, I did notice that we're going to be kind of going backwards and forwards to different areas because there's like a few different routes. So that's going to be cool. All right. And that's the thing we couldn't get through. All right. What's this? Very legend. <laughs> Last death. Uh, shows the tree. Respawn point. Okay. So the tree counts as a respawn point. Uh, one-way blocker. Oh, okay. So we could only, so we get back from this way, but we can't go that way. So I wonder if it's like some way that we go down here leads us back up. Personal marker. Okay, that's cool. Hey, I might as well show you a neat trick to remember places on Mount Calf. Mount Quaff is full of unreachable passages uh, and treasures. Wait, so we can like take like a, a snapshot? Capture an image of the environment. That's actually pretty, that's really interesting. That's cool. Uh, don't forget to capture images of your surroundings regularly to add them to the map and come back uh, to them later. All right. Okay. Oh, and it shows you on the map. That's handy. And then, can you, like, remove them? Review. Delete memory. Hey, that's cool. So then, oh, that makes... Okay, I'm gonna like this system. I'm a, I'm a completionist. And I collect a thon, like a... I like doing collect a thon stuff. I don't know your name. My name is Faraba. I'm Sargon. Warrior of the Immortals. Oh. Doesn't that sound impressive? <laughs> I know it does sound pretty impressive. Well, Sargon, I'm sure we'll meet again in Mount Car. I'll share my discoveries with you when I can, but I'll need time crystals to do it. Time crystals, okay. We got some time elements in this. I'm keen. Time crystals? Is that what the blue things were? <laughs> Welcome to Mount Car. The, the blue things are like the mana that we have down there. Surely, surely I could jump high enough. Huh. Who would put that in such an inconvenient place? <laughs> Who designed this castle? We have healed and it says 14. Does that mean that we can only put 14 markers and we have to get more? Okay. Huh. Ah. Aha, get wrecked. Ah. 
Ugh. Wait, was that him poking me or was that the arrow? Okay, hold on. How do I fight this? Looks awfully suspicious. <laughs> okay. No. Should have killed me. Oh. oh, is that a time crystal? He could, okay, that makes sense. Oh, this is where the whole, like, thing's being frozen in time, maybe? Eee. Interesting. Did I see what was down here? Right here? Definitely feels fluent. Ooh, here we go. Okay, it's teaching us something. No, I didn't mean. Oh, well, I guess we do that now. What do we get? Tarnishing cracked. The inscription is only uh, partially visible. Long heart reflect. Mm. Man, there's a lot of references to the Prince of Persia series. Like I've noticed when when you die, it is like the whole like falling back, kind of like raising up. Um, like when. Oh, hello. <laughs> that actually kind of scared me. Um, like when the prince would step into the sands and he'd get those visions. It kind of like when he dies, kind of the same thing happens, which is cool. I like that reference. Uh, also, the the mirror. It's kind of. Uh, it might be a Did nod to. You found a path to Prince Hassan and Anahita. Anahita, that's her name. Uh, the the mirror might be like kind of a nod to the the mirror version of the prince. I think it's in 
the first Prince of Persia where you uh, have to like fight your mirror version like, maybe it's a nod to that uh... no have you it seems they avoided the depths of the Citadel only the most abominable creatures lurk in the darkest reaches I do my best work in the shadows and Hassan is not here don't take unnecessary risks Thanks for the warning, Rajin. Rajin? You are very tall. Wow, you are crazy tall. I say with that really bulky dude, who's also really tall. Oh, hello. Oh! Excuse me. Oh, am I poisoned now? Great. <laughs> oh, hell no. Uh oh. I was poisoned? Ah! Oh, that scared me. What was that? Oh, it was the water. If you could call it that. Oh man, I start so far back. Do I have to fight these every time? Can I just like avoid them? I don't really want to. <laughs> I really want to fight them every single time. See? See how he like leans back? He also does that when you pick up the health upgrade in uh, Warrior Within. Woo. Don't have time for you. if I take damage? Interesting. I suppose you probably would get like stuck. It like hit you multiple times. So that might be why they added it so it did that. <coughs> Radditch? <laughs> I can't remember her name. I think it was Radditch. I have to start all the way back from here. That is... Ah, oh, that's going to be annoying. Is it? Surely there's like a, a checkpoint. Alright. You're all like... Huh!
I am really good at video games. <laughs> Very good. Let's see, how far have we gone? Okay, we made it here. What is... actually, what is up here? Okay, that's just the door. I love how, how swift I move. There's like a thing. Oh. It's down here. Okay. Yeah, down here. I just love moving around, it's so good. It feels so quick and agile. Boom! does in combat. Alright, you know what? I think we've hit the 30 minute mark, so I'm gonna I'm gonna end it here. Uh we're gonna be <laughs> I have a feeling we're gonna be dying a lot. Um in the next episode with what's coming up. So hopefully we can get past it. Um but that's kind of the fun of this. If if I die too much I might do more of an edit on this series because I know that um it can get repetitive. And I don't want to, like, make a really long set of episodes. So if it's in order to keep me short, I might uh, do some more editing. And kind of working out this channel is a little bit um, of a a learning experience as well. So, um, yeah, I think if I if I keep struggling in areas, I might do an edit to kind of get past it. I'll, I'll make sure I keep the, the fun and important stuff in. Um, but if I'm, like, dying over and over... Uh, Unless, unless you guys enjoy watching that, um, 
and watching me rage just let me know i'll be i'll be curious to know but i think i might edit that out if i continue to kind of die um but yeah i so far like man the the game just moving around oh what did i do oh, i just healed uh what like just moving around is so satisfying uh, especially with the parkour and stuff uh jumping grabbing onto ledges and like it's very fluid uh, and being able to like just slide into combat Ooh, hello Ooh. like just 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 the ability to move around it so freely it feels really good like it's not the same as the prince of persia games from like the trilogy but it's in a way more fluid it feels so it feels so buttery smooth also i noticed when i loaded up the game it said recommended playing with a controller i also recommend playing with a controller because man it's so good it just it just feels right and that's that's one thing i think um when it comes to prince of persia games that they always they always seem to get right was the control scheme and being able to control from a controller uh like it just it just felt like the right device it was almost like the game was made to be played with a controller um or like the controller came out specifically so prince of persia could exist because of how kind of synergized the controls are with the controller um but yeah um if you guys have enjoyed this series and you're enjoying it so far let me know in the comments i'm curious to know uh, if you played it and that sort of stuff um how far are you do you find this hard um i am playing it on I think hard. I'll have to check. Uh, let's have a look. System options. I can't remember what difficulty we chose. I think we chose hard. So <laughs> we might have to change the difficulty if I, if it is too hard. Nope. Harry difficulty normal. Oh, we we can change. Oh yeah, we're playing on hero. Wait, we can change individual elements. That's actually really cool. So we can adjust it to be a little bit more so we don't have to completely change the difficulty that that's cool i like that that's um i i like when you have the ability to change the difficulty as well because playing games is all about enjoying it and i know some people love the challenge um but for other people they just kind of want to experience the story and they want to get through it so i like that they they allow that and i like the little fine tuning and stuff that they have as well and that's really cool uh but yeah if you've enjoyed this episode and stuff like that leave a like uh comment down below all that sort of stuff um helps out this channel to grow helps to kind of uh get more eyes on the video and stuff um so i'll Thank you so much if you hit the like and uh, don't forget to subscribe as well. That's also important uh, to help this channel grow. Um, but yeah, I'm going to end it here and we'll be back uh, in the next episode. Hopefully not getting too stuck with any of the puzzles. I think instead of maybe editing it, I might drop the difficulty if I can't get past certain, uh, certain aspects. Just because they're probably easy on my behalf and I don't have to like cut out stuff for you guys in terms of like my reactions and stuff um plus you might want to see me rage i know people are sadistic and they like to watch <laughs> watch uh their favorite youtubers uh rage at the games that they play as well so we'll see we'll see whatever is more entertaining as what as i watch this back um will be what i go with uh, but yeah until next time thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next episode